Hey, my name is Mike, and this is a too long didn't read guide for the Chronomatic Anomaly on Mythic. The difference on Mythic is that there's two adds that spawn instead of one. Throughout the fight, the boss will speed up and slow down time, which affects your casting, movement, attack, periodic effect, cooldown, and debuff speeds. Chronometric Particles is a stacking dot put on the tanks, and it will kill you at 10 stacks, as well as do a raid wide AoE, so you want to swap at around 8 stacks. Time release is put on random people and it is a healing absorption. When it expires, it does raid wide AoE for the amount of absorption left. Time bomb is put on random people and it does less raid wide AoE the further away you are, so if you have this, you move away. Two adds will spawn in this fight, one on each side of the Nightwell, so you want to split your raid in half. Interrupt this adds warp Nightwell cast. You cannot interrupt this once the add is under 30% health. When it dies, it splits up into four smaller adds that can be stunned. You want to also interrupt their warp Nightwell cast. When the big add dies, it also drops a orb that tanks want to pick up. This orb deals damage to you as you hold onto it and gives you an extra action button for temporal smash, which you want to use to interrupt power overwhelming. This is a channeled raid wide AoE, and every time this does damage, the boss will get a stacking buff that increases the damage this does. The way we did this is that we coordinated our defensive cool cooldowns to survive for 9 stacks on the first power overwhelming. The second channel we interrupted at 3 stacks, but you can just do this right away. The third channel was interrupted as soon as possible. The fourth channel was at 3 stacks, or again, you can do it right away. And then the fifth channel happens on the third set of adds, so you want to try to interrupt it as quickly as possible. All of our defensives were coming off cooldown at this point, but we wanted to save them because we were burning the boss and our fourth set of adds was spawning soon and we were going to be taking a lot of damage. For the third and fifth power overwhelming to be interrupted immediately, we pulled the boss to one side with the add. Otherwise, he always stayed in the middle. On the third set of adds, we had the entire raid minus one tank and healer go to one side and kill the ad as quickly as possible. Then we took the boss to the other side and cleaved into the other ad while trying to keep it interrupted. We completely ignored the fourth set of adds and just tried to heal through it. Do not stand in orange swirlies or in blue orbs. You can use your offensive cooldowns on pull, on the third set of adds, or after one or both of those third set of adds die. That was a too long didn't read guide for chronomatic anomaly on mythic. If you have any questions, feel free to let me know down below in the comments. Thanks for watching. Have a majestic day!